وما أرسلناك إلا رحمة للعالمين. Today we will learn about another mother of the believers, Ramla bint Abu Sufyan, radiyallahu anha. She is known by her nickname Um Habiba, radiyallahu anha. She was one of the earliest individuals to enter the fold of Islam. She was born in the household of Abu Sufyan ibn Harb, who was a chief of the most powerful tribe of the Quraysh and was at that time one of the greatest enemies of Islam and the Prophet ﷺ. However, growing up in such an anti-Islamic environment, Ramla did not hesitate to accept Islam. She became one of the earliest converts to Islam, along with her husband, Ubaidullah ibn Jahash, the brother of Zainab bint Jahash. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala be pleased with all of them. Ramla had to experience and endure great hardships because of her choice, but she did so with a brave heart and with her head held high. Prophet wasallam ordered the Muslims who were at great risk to migrate to Abyssinia. She migrated to Abyssinia along with her husband. Over there, her little baby daughter was born. They named her Habiba. And so, Ramla radiallahu anha earned the title of Um Habiba. That means the mother of Habiba. Soon after, her husband reverted back to his old ways. He left the fold of Islam and decided to embrace Christianity instead. Ramla radiallahu anha remained firm on Islam. She lived in Abyssinia till her husband's death and she became a widow. Many years had passed. The Prophet wasallam by this time had migrated to Medina. A companion relayed the news of the migrants to Abyssinia to the Prophet ﷺ. He was told about Ubaidullah and that he had reverted to Christianity and that he had passed away and about the hardships that Umm Habiba radiallahu anha was facing. After a short time, Umm Habiba radiallahu anha was welcomed with a marriage proposal made by Negus, the king of Abyssinia, on behalf of the Prophet ﷺ. She was overjoyed at the proposal and readily accepted. Negus acted as her wali and arranged the wedding ceremony on the Prophet ﷺ's behalf. Then he sent her to Medina with a trusted party. Finally, Um Habiba radiallahu anha was united with the Prophet ﷺ in Medina. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala be pleased with her and bless her soul. With this, we come to the end of today's episode. Please don't forget to press the like button and subscribe to our channel, Zil Noreen. Until next time, Jazakallahu Khair and Assalamu Alaikum. وَمَا أَرْسَلْنَاكَ إِلَّا رَحْمَةً لِلْعَالَمِينَ